no one could replace your mom. But I can be your babysitter. I guess. Oh, um, I think your dad is here. Perfect timing. Uh, come on, you better go. Darn. Can you babysit me again soon? Yeah, sure, sure. Oh my gosh, I am so glad he had a great time, but I do not want him to start thinking that I'm his mom. I don't know if I should tell Adam or if I should just leave it alone and not make a big deal out of it unless he brings it up again. But uh, that is very awkward. If only he had known the truth about his mom. Oh, that, that would be really bad. Anyway, Adam did pay me, uh, which is good. But I tried to insist and tell him he didn't have to. But he was like, yeah, let's do it. Take it. So he gave me two diamond blocks. It's nice. It's all right. You know, don't really need it with all the diamonds I have already. But... <laughs> You know, that's still good. So I think uh, I'm just going to go ahead and put some of this stuff away that I have. And then I think I'm just going to head to bed. It is quite late. And taking care of kids is very, very draining. You don't realize it, but uh, it definitely is. So I'm going to head to sleep because I'm tired. And we'll see what the morning brings. Grandma? Huh? Whoa, whoa. Um... Hey, Beth. Uh, good, good morning. What are you doing here? I wanted you to take you to the park again. Do your parents know that you're here? No. Beth, you can't sneak out of the house without telling your parents. Sorry, I just really wanted to go. You're lucky, because I hate doing stuff in the morning, but I just love you so much. But we need to ask your parents first, okay? Yay, okay. Well, don't get too excited. They haven't said yes yet. Hey, Remy. This little munchkin over here came to visit me today. How did you sneak out? Oh, it's not a big deal. Don't get mad at her. Um, at least she only went to my house. But, by the way, why isn't she at school yet? Surely she's old enough now. Didn't you hear? The school has kind of just been abandoned. What? There's more kids in this village than ever. Does Adam know? Yes, he promised a new teacher, but she never showed up. Ugh, I'm gonna have to have a word with Adam. Also, can you please take her to the park? Because she really, really loves it. Okay, I'm busy, but I'll ask Richard. Richard? How is he, by the way? He's great. He's been opening up a lot more now. What did you say to him? Oh, that's good to hear. Um, what did I say? Uh, not, nothing much, really. Anyways, um, let me go have a word with Adam. Uh, Beth, you heard it. Your dad's gonna take you to the park. Well... I couldn't find Adam, just his doppelgangers that I kept thinking were Adam, but they weren't. Ugh. Um, but I, I cannot believe that this school has been abandoned and no one has said anything. I'm going to have a look around and see. What in the world is this? I did not know it was this bad. These maps are outdated. There's no chairs for anyone. The chalkboards are gone. What the heck has Adam been doing then? I mean... The village is so big. Surely we would have expanded the school, not just got rid of it. What's in this chest? Not much. Just books. This isn't enough. I'm going to have to fix this up myself. I'm going to have to fix these maps. This is incredible. We're going to need to get all new maps for the kids. <sighs> I'm going to have to go to my house and check to see what we have there. Until I could find Adam and he could like help out with anything extra that I need. It's unbelievable. There's so many kids. You walk around and you see a kid every single time. And I, if I do get the chance to talk to him, I'm going to have to talk to him about maybe building two schools. One for the younger kids, one for the older ones. It just doesn't seem right to me that we're there. We're living in a village like this right now. Um, I don't think we have much. Besides some chairs, I guess we could use these for... The school. Could use the brewing stand. Uh, the whole place needs to be fixed up. Made so much better. The place looks terrible. I know I was the one that built it, but that was like a long time ago. Uh, do I have any redstone? I don't have any redstone. I don't have anything to build with. It's such a shame. I could get some chairs maybe. But that's about it. I'll see what I could do. Um, let me take this stuff and just see how much more we're going to need. We're going to need lots of chairs, lots of tables. That whole building really needs to be renovated, but I can't do that right now. We'll just have to go with what we've got. We could build the second floor to it. Maybe have 
two teachers, but it seems to be hard enough to find one. So let's see. We do have a chalkboard. We do have a chair. One chair. That's about it. Um, I don't really remember how it was laid out before. Do we have a crafting table in here? We do have some bookshelves, so we'll use these. So let me see what I could do and what we could come up with. All right, so I've put together this much. Still need chalkboards. We don't have any nice chairs. Uh, but these will have to do for the time being. I just feel like this whole place is so crammed up. Like, it's just not functional enough. Uh, I really think I shouldn't spend too much time working on this. Because we're going to have to expand this. At least by a few blocks that way. Um, I don't even have any more tables. But I guess... The brewing stands and so could go here for the kids' science lessons. And look at this. How barbaric are we? We have torches. Um, but I was able to trade with one of the villagers for some redstone. So we're going to use these to make some redstone torches. Maybe this will make a nicer lighting. I mean, the environment, the kids learning is important. That matters. I mean, nobody wants to go to a bad, ugly school. So let's fix it up a little bit. Um, I'm thinking, look at this. It's just the sky. That is it. All right, so we're going to put... I should have kept redstone like that. We're going to put a couple of redstone lamps. I don't... Yeah, it's not going to work like that. Okay, what if we do this instead then? And then we put the redstone there like that. There we go. Kind of make some cool lighting, I guess. Not really, but that's the best we can do. So that's what we're going to go with for now. Uh, oh, oh no. I placed way too many there. Let's go there. And then we'll have one here. Like that. Perfect. And then we're going to put one more over here. And hopefully, once I've done this, I can go find Adam. Oh, the bookshelf is going there though. So you can't put one there or there, I don't think. No, we can't. All right. Um, how, should, how did I get up here? Where's my little, my little ladder that I made? Oh, there it is. All right, let's take this down and then put the ceiling back up. So the last thing we need is rain getting in here. There we go. Perfect. All right, that's the best we got for now. Um, I'm going to go try to see if I can find Adam now. Hopefully we can. Because this is just ridiculous. Oh, you know what? I'm just going in again. <laughs> Who listens to doorbells anyways? Is he there? Yes, he is. Adam, I need to speak to you. Yes? Do you know that there's no teacher at the school? Yeah. Well, don't you think Forrest and the rest of the kids need to go? Yeah, but I didn't think it was a big deal. Well, I think it kind of is. I fixed up the school myself for now, but you need to find a teacher and you need to get me more supplies because that school is a mess. I've tried and tried to find a teacher. I even tried to convince the old lady that stays home all day. But she says she hates kids. Okay, we'll try finding a teacher from another village. Teachers are hard to find. Hey, why don't you teach them? What? I'm not a teacher. Well, just until I find one. Adam, you can't just expect me to go in there and be a teacher. <sighs> you know what? I hate you sometimes, but fine. But you only get two weeks to find one. That is it. I'm not going to be their teacher for any longer than two weeks. Are you listening? Yes, yes, two weeks. And you better get me those supplies. And we're starting tomorrow. So I am up super, super early. And like I said last time, I ain't being up early. But I need to finish up this classroom because today is seriously the first day of school. I put out flyers and everything. These kids better show up. If not, I will go to their houses and I will drag them in here. Um, but Adam did get me a few more things. I just need to do a little finishing touches. So we got some canvases and stuff. I'm also thinking about changing up the way I was going to do the tables. And just having like two side by side like that might be better. And then we'll have one um, right here. I don't know, because now we're not going to be symmetrical and stuff, and it's going to bug me. <sighs> yeah, yeah, I maybe we could have just one here like this. And then we've got some nice chairs for them, so at least they'll be somewhat comfortable, hopefully. And they could go here. You know what, I think, I still feel like they're way too crammed up, but we're not going to really be able to change up the school until the weekend time. So we're going to leave it like that. Maybe just, you know what, I'm just going to go with four. Because there are a lot of kids, but I doubt a lot of them are going to show up. Because I don't think anybody cares about the education system right now. So we're going to do that. Um, oh, also, I wanted to get a pet fish for the class because kids love pet fish. So um, I think I'm going to put it here. Just have that. And the 
final touch is the most important touch and that is my beautiful little flower that i'm gonna put right on my desk look at that i'm gonna sit right here and i'm gonna look so fabulous look at me i'm gonna be the greatest teacher in the world um so right now uh we just wait for the kids i guess oh i'm nervous all right class hello welcome to your first day uh i not a lot of you guys shut up, but that's okay, you know. Good thing I didn't put all those shares because it would have been embarrassing. I am so glad, Amity, that your parents sent you to school. Tell them I said thank you. Beth, please turn around. Look, I'm basically not grandma right now. I'm your teacher. Can you please turn around? No? I'm going to tell your parents. You just wait. Forced. Adam basically forced you to be here as well. So don't worry. We'll get more students here. Not a problem. Um, so to the first day, uh, we're going to do some uh, science stuff. Yeah, and... I just want to introduce myself in case you guys don't know who I am. My name is Dai, and I would be the worst teacher. Not the worst. <laughs> the meanest teacher you've ever had. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'm not. I'm going to be very nice. And you did you just say I look scary? Did, did you just say I look scary? You haven't seen scary yet. And this is where I was going to get to. The rules. No talking. Unless you raise your hand and I, I, I let you talk. Um, you must do all your homework. You must show up on time. And you must not say mean things to your teacher and tell them they look scary. I look scary because I haven't slept today. How are you? I'm doing very good things for asking for us. Um, so yeah, let's get right into our lesson. Oh my gosh. Well, I am glad that is over. <sighs> I never want to do that again. Why did I promise Adam I would do that for two weeks? <sighs> kids kids are very difficult sometimes, I must say. What, what am I supposed to teach them? I taught them all I know about science today, which is just that water is made up of H2O. <laughs> That's all I know. But I have no idea what I'm going to do. I, I am going to need all the luck in the world. I am hoping Adam finds a teacher. <laughs> if not, I'm going to go out there and I'm going to try to find one myself. I will have, I'll pay someone to be a teacher. Double what Adam pays them if that's what it takes. Oh, that was terrible. I mean, the kids were really nice and they listened and stuff, but I just feel like I am not cut out. What? What's Cam doing here? That's weird. Um, and maybe Willow's back in town? I don't know, we'll have to find out. But yes, I was not born to teach. Not at all. Mm -hmm.